Hey, what's up, Aaron here. Hope you're doing well. If you're watching this video right now, you might be checking out this app right here called Cash Cow. And maybe you're wondering, can you actually make money just from playing games? Let's check it all out, right? Is this legit? Is it a waste of time? Anytime, if you want to find out my favorite way to get to $10,000 or more a month, 100% from home, click the link below and I'll share with you my favorite strategy. Now on this channel, I've reviewed literally hundreds and hundreds of different ways to make money online, all right? Some of them really good, some of them it's so-so. A lot of them though, a big waste of time. So let's check out Cash Cow to find out how good this little gaming app really is and is it worth your time? That's a big question, right? So a lot of things allow you to make money, but it's whether or not it's worth your time, right? Are you exchanging a lot of time for making that small amount of money? Now, Cash Cow is another app by Playtime. Playtime is a very popular software company that makes a lot of gaming apps. And the way it works is they make money from showing you ads and then as you play the games, uh, they show you more ads, so they make ad revenue, and then they pay you a little bit of money just for spending more time on the app, okay? And so that's exactly how Cash Cow works. Now, if you download it from the Google Play Store, you can see that there are a million plus downloads. It's a very popular app, all right? And it basically looks like this. It's very simple, right? They've got a bunch of different games that you can play. It's very simple. You download the app, you play the games. And the way it works is they're going to show you how many coins you can make for every game that you play. Now, when you first start the games, which is the same for every single Playtime app, and actually a lot of gaming apps as well, is when you first play it, it looks like you can make a lot of coins for every minute that you play, all right? So if I was to start Family Farm, for example, um, the amount of coins I could make would say something like 400 or 500 coins per minute, okay? And that sounds like a lot of coins, right? But I'll t tell you exactly how much they're worth at the end of this video, so stick around, okay? So once that, once, once that happens, you really do make the coins, which is nice, but as you play the game more and more, and maybe you come back the next day, what's gonna happen is the coins will drop from 500 a minute to, to much, much less, okay? Because they use the coins as a high amount to entice you to start playing, but over time, they're gonna drop that amount so that you make less and less money for the amount of time that you're playing on the app, all right? so. When you first start, you can you can make a lot of money uh, or more money, but then eventually it starts to get more and more difficult. Now, the other way that you can actually earn as well is you can fill out surveys, okay? And the, but the surveys pay very little, okay? They only pay between nine and four coins per survey that you fill out, which is roughly about 10 to 15 minutes per survey. So I wouldn't even waste time with the surveys. If you want to use Cash Cow, just play the games, okay? And that's it. Now, you can withdraw mainly through PayPal, which is really cool. And they have some gift cards as well. It depends on where you live in the world. The minimum is $5 to withdraw, right? And that's roughly about 3,500 coins. Sometimes it goes up to about 4,000 coins for every $5, okay? Um, and it takes roughly a few days for the money to actually be, you know, received into your account, okay? Now, the big question is, is how much, um, you know, can you really make from this app, okay? Because they, it, they make it look easy, it makes it sound like you download it and it's fun and you play the games and you can make a lot of money, but the reality is it's, it's something like this. If you play the games for roughly about one hour, you will make roughly about 50 cents per hour. Okay, so it's a not it's not a lot of money, but for a free gaming app, it's actually also not bad. I mean, I've reviewed other gaming apps in the past where they pay way 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 less than 50 cents an hour. Most of the time it's like, you know, 1 cent an hour, <laughs> something like that. So, to be able to make um and, and by the way, that's up to 50 cents, okay? It's usually a little bit less. You know, you might make 30 cents, you might make 40 cents. It depends on the game and it depends on your luck. If you're lucky and you get a game where you can make a lot more money or if you're just getting started with the app, you can make a lot more money. And I do want to mention that when you first download the app, they do give you a bonus. They give you about 4,500 coins as a bonus, okay? So um, right at the start, when you first play, it's going to be pretty with easy to withdraw because you get the bonus, you get the high coin payout. Um, so you can, the first time, you can withdraw quite a decent amount of money quickly. But when you start again the next day or the day after and stuff like that, you don't get the bonus and then the coins that you can earn per game goes down significantly. So it starts to become very, very hard to make a lot of money with this particular app, okay? Now, I, I do wanna kinda go into the reviews just so that you can see you know what people are saying in general, okay? And it, it has generally you know high amounts of uh, you know ratings, about 4.4 stars, right? 
but I generally like to look at the low ratings to see what's the biggest complaint that people are saying, okay? Um, it says, I don't recommend it because supposedly earn discounts with Amazon and Walmart, that they aren't, but they aren't redeemable. All you get is a link to the sale pages on the respective pages. I expected coupons, but I couldn't. This apparently is the only way to get in touch with them. There's no other option for customer service. Basically, the customer service is really bad. Okay, um, this one says, the choices of apps to download are very few. I couldn't download the ones I wanted. I had two apps downloaded, but only received credits for playing one. I decided to cash out $1.25 to my PayPal, which is supposed to be instant, but it never was and never went through. There's just not enough interesting games for me. I don't like apps that advertise one thing, but they don't do it at all, okay? Um, I sent 125 euros in PayPal, um, but it doesn't it doesn't put it as a usable balance. So Beth didn't actually get the money that she expected, right? This one says, do not use, the app is a scam. I cashed out a $10 certificate, but I never received it. I emailed the company and received a response saying someone would get back to me, but no one did. I have since cashed out a $5 certificate and that one came in a few days. So I know all the information is correct. So again, you know, uh, Dana got her money, but it wasn't the ten dollars and she really had to kind of you know wrestle with customer uh, service right one star here total ripoff don't play this app i played the game accumulated enough coins to make three different cash outs right after it's still pending like 45 minutes after the fact i couldn't be more furious for the waste of time support doesn't exist either so i think here's here's the bottom line right with a lot of playtime apps if you're lucky they work but sometimes they're glitchy Okay, so the thing is, is that if you're going to be spending time playing an app um, and it doesn't give you the amount of money that you spent the time for, I think it's a big waste of time. Now, that doesn't mean that Cash Cow doesn't work because they've got a lot of people using it. And I think if you're lucky and it works, some people do get to cash out properly, like I mentioned earlier. But if you're unlucky, sometimes there are some tech glitches and you don't really get the money that, that you know, is, is paid, you know, that's worth to you, right? And then the question you have to ask yourself, is one dollar of your time for every, you know, 30, 40, 50 cents, you know, to be earned, is that really worth your time? Right? I mean, I, I don't think it's a big, you know, use of your time. I mean, if you like playing games and you don't mind just, you know, playing some of their games here and just having a good time, if you make some money, that's great. If you don't make any money, it's not a problem. Then I would say use Cash Cow. But if you're here to make money, I think this is one of the worst ways to make money because you're wasting a lot of time and you're making pennies on the dollar, which doesn't really make sense, okay? So if you wanna check out Cash Cow, you can download it from the Google Play Store, Cash Cow, and you can check it out if you want, all right? Now, if you're watching this video right now, um, I've reviewed hundreds of different strategies to make money online. Some of them are good, some of them are so-so. A lot of them though, kind of like Cash Cow, are a big, big waste of time, I think, personally, right? Because if you have two or three hours a day to spend online, you should be making hundreds of dollars, not 10 cents, 20 cents, 30 cents here and there, if that makes sense, right? Now, out of all the strategies I've reviewed, there's one strategy that I use specifically to quit my full-time job in 2019. I used it to five times my salary. I've made almost $2 million uh, in sales with this particular strategy. So if you wanna check that out, click the link below. I've got a free masterclass that shows you how I did it step-by-step, step, and you can have a look at it if you would like to, all right? I hope you enjoyed this review of Cash Cow. All the best to you. See you on another video review. Take care.